A young driver has escaped jail after fleeing a fatal hit and run last year, which claimed the life of a medical student. Gabriel de Bono's heartbroken parents say they've been robbed of justice, while his girlfriend says she feels like a widow. Gabrielle de Bono and his girlfriend Claire Bosworth were high school sweethearts. He was my partner and I planned on spending my life with him. But he died in her arms 10 hours after being struck by a car while walking home in an Oomba. 20-year-old Casey Power admitted driving over him. She says she panicked and fled. And she'll never understand what it's like for me having to lie in bed with him and watch him die. And to feel like you're a widow at 20 years of old age. Power was charged with callous disregard for failing to remain at the scene and sentenced to six months imprisonment wholly suspended. Police couldn't prove if her car or another caused the fatal blow. So it seems we will never know what happened to our Gabriel <laughs> or why. <laughs> but we thank everyone for their support. Parents Barbara and Francis de Bono today sought and received an apology from Power. He was just amazing. He was amazing. He was just wonderful. I wasn't even joyful. But Claire says she can't forgive nor forget. She's taken someone who would have greatly helped the world at large. Gabrielle's family is raising funds in his memory for Doctors Without Borders. And we hope that we can do even better for this wonderful medical organisation that Gabriel had thought he may one day volunteer for. Eamon Atkinson, 7 News.